More news coming in. The Korean government has committed to supporting Uganda through increased equipping of youth with digital financial skills and knowledge. In a dialogue with key partners here in Kampala, the Uganda Federation Community Credit Cooperative Chief Executive Officer, that is Andrew Chempa, says they're looking at the creation of inclusive youth cooperatives. If you're a small player, you cannot survive. The Korean government, through the Uganda Federation of Community Credit Cooperatives operating in PG and Mtiana, has committed to supporting inclusive digital finance for agribusiness. The move seeks to address unemployment through increasing access to finances among the youth. Let us embrace the power of education and awareness as you introduce the digital financial system to the youth. We must ensure they are equipped with the knowledge and skills to use these tools responsibly and confidently. We have realized that there is a need for the different players within the financial te technology sector to come together to continue discussing the issue of the youth because the youth we are talking about are not the same across regions. The Federation's Chief Executive Officer, Chepa Andrew, says they are optimistic that if given the right attention, the program has the capacity to see more youth join agribusiness and improve their livelihoods. So today we have come together as different stakeholders offering financial products to discuss how we can tailor what we are doing to the specific needs of the youth, especially those in the rural communities and those in the agribusiness sector. These say they are looking at rolling out the youth-led financial cooperatives across the country as they move to boost digital cooperatives for vulnerable groups. But we shall have youth groups across the four regions of Uganda where they will come up and they will establish an MG which is a cooperative model uh, <clears throat> that they will be using to access financial services. The young people that we are trying to tailor products for are so innovative. They are moving faster than us who are providing the services. So we need to adjust, we need to be flexible in the way we are doing things to make sure that we are moving together with the youth. In a dialogue with key stakeholders in Kampala, Korea also committed to support the sector to ensure that no one is left behind. It is through strong partnership that we can create the enabling environment for the adoption and utilization of digital financial services, ensuring that no one left behind. So looked at the issue of ensuring that our products, especially the financial products, are safe and secure. Because if they are not safe and secure, then adaptation to these products will be, continue to be a challenge. Salman Amwanje, Alan Musigwa, NBS. And away from that, the Nakaseke Deputy.